Happy Thursday, class. We will be reviewing some of our trickier words that we've learned um, in our last eight lessons because we have a quiz on them tomorrow. So all these snow days actually gave us an extra re review day. So that's pretty nice. We're going to start with all of our two-way words. All right, so I'll tell you the word and you tell me how we say it to spell it. All right, our first two-way word is interest. Interest. How do we say that to spell it, class? All right, if you're not sure, listen. When we're talking, it sounds like it's two syllables. To spell it, it's three syllables. Interest. Say that with me, class. Interest. Good. One more time, how do we say interest to spell it? Good, interest. All right, besides that, the only thing we need to remember is which er we use, class. Which er do we use in interest, or as we say to spell it, interest? All right, we use our most common er, er the er of her. All right, so go ahead and Write those, write your word interest. Say the sounds while you write them and then mark them. All right, pause the video t if you're not finished. So, in ter. Est. All right, and then class, what gets our thinking cap? All right, good, it's our er. All right, one more time, class, how do we say interest to spell it? If we can just read it, interest. Excellent. Our next word is, our next two-way word is picture. Picture. All right, class, think back, how do we say picture? to spell it. This one was kind of tricky. It's got that U that distorts the sound of a consonant before it. So to spell picture, we say picture. All right, say that with me, picture. All right, good. One more time, how do we say picture to spell it? Good, picture. All right, and then we just have to Remember how we make that uh, you, u, u, say you. So go ahead and write the sounds, say them while you write them. All right, pause the video if you're not finished yet. So pick. Sure. All right, this one gets two thinking caps, one on our T that gets distorted, and then one on these two. So excellent work if you remembered all of that. All right, our next two-way word is climb. Mm, how do we say climb to spell it? Good, we have to say climb, climb. All right, go ahead and write and mark climb. All right, pause the video if you're not finished yet. Ooh, I, mm, oh, I should have reminded us that, um, class, what's letting our it, I, e say I here? All right, I and O may say I and O when followed by two consonants. Should have told you that before we started. All right, our next two-way word is color. Color. Class, how do we say color to spell it? 
All right, so there's two different things that we, it's a two-way word in two ways. So something's different in each syllable. Color. All right, listen, we say color. All right, cl class, say that with me. Color. Good, one more time. How do we say color to spell it? Good, color. All right, go ahead and write it. Say it while you're writing it and then mark it. All right, pause the video if you're not finished yet. So our first syllable is call. Our second syllable is or. Remember, we've got our R and or usually say er in an unstressed syllable. All right, our next two way word is wagon. Class, how do we say wagon to spell it? Wagon. All right, listen. Wagon. Wagon. All right, say that with me, class. Wagon. Good. Now, one more time. How do we say wagon to spell it? Good. Wagon. So make sure you're finding the syllables. Go ahead and write wagon. Say the sounds while you write it and then mark it. All right, wag on. Our first syllable is wag. Our second syllable is on. All right, our next two-way word is wonder. Class, how do we say wonder to spell it? Wonder. All right, if you aren't sure, listen, we say wander, wander. All right, class, so say that with me, wander. All right, one more time, how do I say wonder to spell it? Good, wander. And we just have to remember which er, it's our most common one. So go ahead and write wander, say the sounds while you're writing them and then mark it. All right, so pause the video if you're not finished yet. Our first syllable is wan. And our second syllable is der. And we were using our most common er, er, the er of her. And this is what's different. All right, this is our base word. Our next word is wonderful. Wonderful. Class, how do we say wonderful to spell it? All right, good. We say wonderful wonderful all right so this is our base word just like this and then we'll just add full at the end go ahead and write it say the sounds while you're writing them and then mark it all right pause it if you're not finished yet our first syllable is wan, just like in our base word. Our second syllable is der. All right, whenever we're adding the suffix full, it's going to look like this. All right, so this is a suffix that we see often in English, like an awful. Um, there's other words too, I just can't remember them right now. So anytime we have that full suffix, it's always gonna be spelled that way. That's why suffixes and prefixes are kind of nice. They 
are always spelled the same. All right, our last two-way word in list K is against. Class, how do we say against to spell it? All right, again, there's two things that are different between against and how we say it to spell it. All right, we say against to spell it. Say that with me, against. Good, so two things are changing. All right, um, one more time. How do we say against to spell it? Good, against. So go ahead and, oh, the other thing that we need to remember is which A we use in our second syllable. Class, can you tell me which A we use in our second syllable? All right, it's a two-letter A that we do not use at the end of English words. All right, so go ahead and write and mark a against. Can you pause the video if you're not finished yet? A is our first syllable, against is our second syllable. I'm just going to put the thinking cap on this one because remember we see this by itself in its own syllable at the front all the time and it's it almost always says a. Uh. Maybe always, I'm not sure, but almost always this is going to be a. Uh. So we're not going to, it doesn't get a thinking cap anymore. We just remember it. All right, class, these are our eight two-way words that will be on our quiz tomorrow. So if you don't remember how to say any of them to spell them, this should help you. Um, you can also always go back and listen, you know, a couple more times to just and practice saying the words.